Hello and welcome to the PCM Tech Help Show. I'm your host, Craig Chamberlain, and that's at PCMTechHelp.com. Now, this is the Faster XP 2012 series, and this series is going to have a large number of videos, and it's going to debut every Monday at 10 a.m. Eastern. Don't worry, it's not the only series of videos I am going to do. In this video, we're going to disable the Windows XP desktop wallpaper. Now, this is extremely beneficial to those of you who actually have low memory Windows XP systems, which believe me, you're still out there. For those of you who don't have much memory, you want to make sure that you disable the XP wallpaper because a lot of times the wallpaper that people decide to throw on their computer desktop is some awesome family photo they took with their 7500 gigapixel digital camera. Well, that 70 million gigapixel digital camera takes extremely high resolution photos and those extremely high resolution photos when put on your desktop chews up a ton of system memory, which is bad because we want our computers to run fast, right? So you can either optimize that image, which there's a number of ways you can do that. Uh, you might want to Google how to do it. There's a couple just, you know, optimize my image, you know, websites just say optimize photo and I guarantee you'll come up with a tool or something that'll let you do it. And uh, if not, we're just going to disable it or put one of the default Windows XP ones. So let's go ahead and get started. And first thing you want to do, it's very easy to do, just right click on your desktop and select properties and it's going to bring up your display properties. Now at this point you just need to select the desktop tab at the top and it'll show the whole slew of backgrounds that you have available to you. Now if you want to just disable it you can scroll all the way up to the top of your list and just select none and then you can choose a color if you so choose to be your background color. Typically I'll keep the default one. At that point, all you need to do is select apply and your desktop background is disabled. Now I'm not actually gonna do that on this one. Well, I'll show you what it looks like. Default color looks pretty good actually considering, uh, but we went ahead and disabled it and now actually the, the image that was loaded into memory isn't gonna be loading up as much memory on my desktop. So at this point, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna put my actual wallpaper back on there because it's a video. I want you guys to see my propaganda. But uh, that's all there is to this video. That shows you how to disable your Windows XP desktop wallpaper. And, and for those of you who are like, this is never going to help me. This is completely useless. Remember, you might not be the person who has the extremely large photo on their desktop. The 9 million megapixel. So that's what this is for. That's, those are the people this is for. If it's not you, just move on. And you can also use the default one because it's already optimized. So as always, thanks for stopping by. Don't forget to leave comments and ratings and subscribe. You can follow me on Facebook and Twitter. You can also put me in your circles on Google+. And I'm like on every social network there is. I'm even on Empire Avenue. I do all kinds of geeky stuff there. And don't forget to join the PCM Tech Help community. Become a PCM techie and you can get free unlimited tech support from yours truly. Assuming I you know, don't die of exhaustion. As always, I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks again.